wow, would you take a gander at this cool little cluster of redwood trees here? Is this a cluster of different trees or is this all actually just one tree growing in a really funky, weird way that we have trouble understanding? And what the cuss is going on? Well, a really common trait for coastal redwoods is that they're really good at vegetative regeneration, specifically sprouting new basal shoots. This is a common adaptation that many trees will do in response to some sort of trauma event in an attempt to generate more branches and leaves more quickly to photosynthesize, to create more sugar so that they can endure and survive. You can actually see a very similar thing happening with this alder tree right here. All these little basal shoots coming up, probably in response to some sort of fungi or bug infestation, so it can you know try to generate the sugars it needs to survive. With redwoods, you'll commonly see it as they experience disturbance like a fire or being cut down where a bunch of new little shoots will sprout out around the side or the base of the old tree utilizing and still connected to the network and all the mycorrhizal fungi connections that the original tree would have had and sometimes that original tree will survive the initial trauma that caused it to sprout all those shoots like we can see here where this tree probably sprouted these five main basal shoots following a fire which we can still see the scars from on the initial tree here. But now this tree has six main stems all photosynthesizing and growing from that same root network. So yes, these trees here are all actually just the same one tree. So while we tend to think of trees as individuals based on a single stem, it's important to remember that trees are actually relatively moldable and adaptable organisms. You know, nature is wiggly. And that when they sprout new shoots that eventually grow into what we would consider to be individual trees, it's actually just that same organism doing whatever can to survive. You often hear talk about these other shoots as being clones or new trees because you know our capacity of understanding the adaptability and resilience of these organisms is just so far unlike anything we experience on our own. So maybe we should express some humility and respect for nature just doing its thing here because life pretty dang wild. Keep on keeping on brother.